Hi everyone, this is Marjorie. Do you lose weight? Do you gain it back? Do you do that over and over? If so, you're in the right place because that's my story and um, I'm here to talk about how I've been successful losing 53 pounds on the ketogenic diet um, at the age of 67 in nine months. Uh, first of all, if you're new here, would you please subscribe and ring the little bell and then you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. And today I want to talk about um, a serious subject um, and that is aging. I watched a YouTube friend of mine, she did a really poignant video um, <clears throat> about her concerns about aging and they're legitimate and they're heartfelt. Um, I'm gonna send you over to her channel. I hope she's okay with that, but she did put it on YouTube. So <laughs> her name is Marjorie Lynn. Love that name. Um, she's very pretty. She does wig reviews and um, she talks about some legitimate concerns and she has some, uh, one really good suggestion. I'm gonna throw it out there too. Anyway. A big problem that we all have as we get older is uh, worrying about Alzheimer's. That's, I mean, how can we live our life if we can't even remember what our past is, you know, remember the loved ones in our past and, and that type of thing. Um, I'm gonna make this kind of brief. I'm not actually going to do the tag, but I'm gonna just touch on some of the subjects that she um, brought up. Um, and I'm going to make some suggestions for people who are worried about this because aren't we all kind of worried about getting older because you know around this house Let's see my husband's 69. I'm 67 That dog is 9. That dog is 13. That cat is 16 My son's even 27. We're all getting old around here. So we got to keep our minds all in check because you know um, Like I said what's it worth if you can't remember things. So one thing that got me started on the ketogenic diet was technically when I watched a TED talk about Alzheimer's. Um, it's by Amy Berger. You can look it up on YouTube and watch it. I don't think it's that long, but it's very uh, engrossing to me. And she also wrote a book and I downloaded that on my Nook or else I would show you that book, but it's called The Alzheimer's Antidote. Now, you know, the, the jury is still out on whether it's technically an Alzheimer's antidote, but there's one thing that being on the ketogenic lifestyle way of eating has done for me and that is to kind of eliminate some of the brain fog that I had. Um, I had so much sympathy when I was watching Marjorie talk about this and I realized that I'm remembering a whole lot more. In fact, everybody around here asks me where everything's at. Of course, that's common, but I mean, I now know where everything's at. <laughs> Whereas I used to just be annoyed, just go find it yourself. But uh, more than that, I remember a lot of things and I, you know, that I used to have a harder time with and I am attributing that to the intake, you know, upping my intake of healthy um, fats, both saturated and unsaturated and monosaturated, um, all of those, MCT oil, uh, grass-fed butter, um, coconut oil, all of these things. When you start reading and studying about how the ketogenic diet works, yeah, it's wonderful that I've been losing weight, but even more than that, I don't have any pain anymore. I don't have inflammation my knee doesn't hurt, my back doesn't hurt, I have more energy. Um, and people could argue that that's because I've lost 53 pounds, but you know what? It's also, I mean, I've lost pounds before and all my aches and pains didn't go away and my brain didn't get clearer. Um, so I would just like to say that um, I think everybody needs to pay attention to the keto diet as they're getting older. I think carbs have absolutely no important place in our diet, especially the amount of carbs that the American standard American diet uh, has in it is ridiculously high, ridiculously high. 
Um, so without giving you a lecture, which I didn't come on here to do, I just thought I would send you over to Marjorie Land. She's got something there that's magic. Uh-oh, let me see. She's got my, I hope that didn't look weird. My battery's getting low. She has um, an article, an item on there that I'm gonna order from Amazon. It's called V-Magic. So go over and check out the magic over there. I'm, and um, by the way, um, I was watching another TED Talk this morning on aging and the woman was talking about, I'm sorry, I don't remember her name. She was talking about being invisible and it made me laugh because <laughs> she said the minute that she let her hair go gray, she felt invisible. Like nobody noticed her anymore, but she wasn't a contributing member of society because she was over the hill. Well, I don't know, I'm not gonna get into any po political discussions here, but um, I don't know if any of you like Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin, but if you haven't seen Grace and Frankie and you haven't laughed for a while, you need to, if you have Amazon Prime, you can get that on your Amazon Prime app for free. Such a hysterical show. Uh, and laughing is so good for us. We need to laugh. We need to smile. As Dolly Parton used to say, smile, it increases your face value. Corny, I know, but I love her too. So anyway, um, another little thing I'd like to touch on is I am getting some keto coaching help. Um, I am uh, utilizing Sarah for the next 30 days because I'm tired of losing as slowly as I have been. In fact, I was at a stall for a while um, and I just like her input. It's not like I don't know what the keto diet is. It's not like I don't talk about it every single day and it's not like I don't read about it every single day and watch all of your YouTube videos about it every single day. But for some reason, after you lose 50, if, if you only have a hundred to lose, you know, if you've got like 150 to lose, the first 50, the first 70 even goes off faster. But if you've lost 50 and you're only wanting to lose another 40, 50, it slows down um, oftentimes. So I want Sarah's input because Sarah's very knowledgeable and she has gotten down from a higher weight. She's gotten down um, to, you know, what I would like to accomplish. So stay tuned and I'll give you all updates on how that's working out. And it better work out because Sarah will chew me out since I came on and told y'all. <laughs> okay, so I'd like to thank you so much for watching. And um, you know what I always say, keep calm and keto on and read about the ketogenic diet for more reasons than just losing weight. Do it for your health. Um, do it for your memory and go see Marjorie Lynn's new video she just uploaded. It's awesome. So anyway, and please give this video a big thumbs up and uh, share and leave me your comments. What are you worried about? Um, so bye for now. See you soon.